Paper 85, The Origins of Worship Primitive religion had a biologic origin, a natural evolutionary development, aside from moral associations and apart from all spiritual influences. The higher animals have fears but no illusions, hence no religion. Man creates his primitive religions out of his fears and by means of his illusions. In the evolution of the human species, worship in its primitive manifestations appears long before the mind of man is capable of formulating the more complex concepts of life now and in the hereafter which deserve to be called religion. Early religion was wholly intellectual in nature and was entirely predicated on associational circumstances. The objects of worship were altogether suggestive. They consisted of the things of nature which were close at hand or which loomed large in the commonplace experience of the simple-minded, primitive Urantians. When religion once evolved beyond nature worship, it acquired roots of spirit origin, but was nevertheless always conditioned by the social environment. As nature worship developed, man's concepts envisioned a division of labor in the supermortal world. There were nature spirits for lakes, trees, waterfalls, rain, and hundreds of other ordinary terrestrial phenomena. At one time or another, mortal man has worshipped everything on the face of the earth, including himself. He has also worshipped about everything imaginable in the sky and beneath the surface of the earth. Primitive man feared all manifestations of power. He worshipped every natural phenomenon he could not comprehend. The observation of powerful natural forces, such as storms, floods, earthquakes, landslides, volcanoes, fire, heat, and cold, greatly impressed the expanding mind of man. The inexplicable things of life are still termed acts of God and mysterious dispensations of providence.